if the resurrection really happened, and if Christmas really is real, then that means that you and I really can have a relationship with God. If, if the resurrection happened and Christmas is real, that means you and I can be saved by grace. That means that the Christmas message is not just do better, live more morally. It's not just one of those crushing moral messages that none of us can live up to. The Christmas message is that the world is a dark place. We've all sinned against God and none of us can work our way to heaven, but that God in love has sent his son to die for our sins on our behalf so that if we would just put faith in Jesus Christ, we could be saved by grace through faith in Jesus Christ alone. It doesn't matter what you do, doesn't matter what you've done, doesn't matter how much good you do after the fact, it doesn't matter how much bad you've done before the fact, you can be saved by grace. And if Christmas is real, then that message is real and it means you and I can have salvation. That's a big deal. You see, it's not just a story. It's not just something people believe, it's history. The Christian faith is based on a historical, verifiable event. It doesn't have to be wishful thinking, it doesn't have to, I hope it's true. You can have certainty, theological certainty that Christmas is real, and if it isn't real, it's just a depressing holiday. I don't blame you for being depressed if you're here tonight and you're depressed if you believe Christmas is just a story. It is a depressing story. It is just live better, be more sacrificial, be more loving. How depressing. <laughs> but if it's real, then everything changes.